A U.S. airman from Daphne killed in what's considered the final battle of Vietnam is among those being honored later this week with a new monument to a forgotten chapter of history. Chad Petrie is live in the studio with more on that story. Good morning, Chad. Good morning, Shimani. Good morning, Bill. The family of Daphne Sergeant Jimmy Black says this is a big honor and long overdue. The Maiguez incident involved the capture of a U.S. cargo ship off the coast of Cambodia after the fall of Saigon in 1975. Black was among 23 airmen who volunteered to be part of a rescue mission. The group was traveling to a staging area when their helicopter crashed, permanently altering the strategy and outcome of the mission. Over the last five decades, Black's niece Jennifer Stelling has been gathering items from her uncle's service and getting documents connected to the incident. I've always had this connection and I feel like maybe I've had this connection for a reason because it's leading to this. I know that I can't change the past, but I'm hoping that some of the men that came home but I feel never really came home um, can find some sort of solace now in knowing that the brothers that they lost, you know, are, are recognized properly and honored properly. This week, a new monument will be dedicated at Joint Base San Antonio Lackland Security Forces Museum. The monument will have the names and images of all 23 who were lost on board the helicopter with the call sign Knife 13. Stelling says she's proud of the monument and hopes this spurs more information and documents to be released from the incident. A group is still raising money for this monument and a second plan for a later date. And for more information, you can find this story on our website at WKRG.com. Chad Petrie, WKRG. News 5.